All right, well, I am officially here at the New York Auto Show for the press days. And there's already been quite a few exciting announcements and I cannot wait to get in here and check out some more stuff. So come along with me. All right, well, this is the Volkswagen ID4 and it would probably do better if they would connect the entire thing. So this is a look at how the battery electric platform on the ID4, which is for all intents and purposes shared across the entire ID lineup, is built and designed. So you can see just the big skateboard platform on the bottom here contains all of the battery cells. And essentially your power charging port here just goes straight into the onboard charger that's back in the back here and that's what actually delivers the power into the batteries here and then you can see how it's connected into the drivetrain here in the back and in the front so this is called the MEB platform which I had never actually seen what it stood for before so currently modular electrification toolkits and this is what's being used, obviously, in the ID4, but also the ID2, the ID Buzz, ID3, uh, ID2 and ID3 are only in Europe, uh, and the upcoming ID5. And what this, uh, so this is what they are going to, or what they have actually already started uh, assembling in Chattanooga, not the batteries, but uh, the car itself, and. On the ID4 Pro, you have 82 kilowatt hour battery that gives a range of 275 miles. And the charging time at a DC public fast charger is 10 to 80% in 30 to 36 minutes. Zero to 60 in 5.7 seconds on the ID4 Pro. All right, and here is the VW ID4. So viewers will know that I'm a big fan of this car and our friends have actually had one for almost a year now. But I think that this is quietly one of the most compelling and interesting, certainly affordable EVs out there right now. So you may not be getting all of the flashy software and features and stuff as a, of a Tesla, but you are getting great build quality from Volkswagen, getting pretty good software, getting a super comfortable, fairly luxurious ride, great materials on the inside, and very affordable car. Plus you get three years of free charging on Electrify America, so it's almost a, uh, it's a very easy car to recommend to anyone kind of getting into their first EV. So this is the Pro S all-wheel drive, which has all-wheel drive, as the name implies, but this is the top of the line one. You can see these aero style wheel caps to give it more range. I believe this is rated to get up to about 275 ish miles of range. And I said that this can charge from 10 to 80% in only about half an hour. All right, this is a cool one with funky kind of blue uh, leather uh, accents in here. So, here fully adjustable power seats with memory, a lot of storage space here for drinks, phone wireless charger, and then a USB-C port here, and in the center console you've got some more space, not a lot but pretty deep, the vents here, and of course your main 12 inch navigation and entertainment screen and the smaller one up over the steering wheel. So, if you watch the ID Buzz video, you see this is very, very similar. I mean, they're built on the same, not only battery platform and drivetrain, but even the technology and stuff in here and a lot of the parts are really shared across. And one of the interesting things is here, the drive selector is actually up here over the wheel, um, connected kind of to the, the screen, and then you twist it to put it into drive or add regenerative braking or neutral or reverse and then park on the side.
and these cool seats here with the little perforations in them. It's like heated seats and are these actually ventilated as well? Um. Oh, there we go. Alright, I'll shut that back off. So lots of space in here. And your charging port. Locked. Okay. Come in here to the back. Lots of room back here as well. So definitely a very comfortable family car. You know, it is a compact SUV. Can fit, I'd say, three kids, two adults back here very comfortably. Got USB-C ports down here for charging. A little bit of storage space here and here, so you don't have the trays of the ID Buzz, but other than that, the seat's pretty much the same thing. And you've got this nice big sunroof, which actually closes, unlike a lot of other EVs. So nice for that. Your center uh, armrest here. It's cup holders and a nice pass-through to the trunk. Can you open it? through to the trunk, get your skis or golf clubs in here. And love the light up Volkswagen badge on here. Something relatively new. And where's the button? And power tailgate and you have this parcel shelf here to separate the trunk from the rest of the cabin which helps with noise isolation and then good amount of space back here for storage we've also got I think a little bit of under yeah a little under storage here and then yet so that folds up you can take that out and then you got this with even more space underneath for I guess where you put your charger So that's the ID4. Very nice, comfortable, convenient family SUV.